Have you ever wondered where else in the universe life could exist? Let's start with Triton, Neptune's largest moon. This celestial body is a realm of mystery and wonder, an icy wonderland that plays host to some of the most intriguing phenomena in our solar system. One such phenomenon is Triton's unusual geysers, which erupt with nitrogen gas. These aren't the water-spewing geysers we're familiar with here on Earth. They're cold and icy, a testament to the frigid temperatures on this distant moon. Yet, despite these harsh conditions, Triton is not as barren as it may seem. Triton's atmosphere holds organic materials, the building blocks of life as we know it. It's a tantalizing hint that life, in some form, could potentially exist there. But it doesn't stop at the atmosphere. Beneath Triton's icy surface, scientists suspect there may be an ocean of liquid water. Yes, you heard it right, an ocean hidden beneath miles of ice. This ocean could be a haven for life, offering a refuge from the freezing surface temperatures. Of course, all of this is still speculation. We've yet to send a mission to Triton to confirm these theories, but that could change in the near future. There's a window of opportunity coming up in 2025 when Triton will be close enough to Earth for us to launch a mission. Back in 2020, NASA was considering a mission to this moon as part of its discovery program. But it eventually selected two missions to Venus instead. So, for now, Triton remains a mystery, its secrets locked beneath a layer of ice. But one thing's for certain, whether it's through telescopes or future space missions, we'll keep looking, keep exploring, keep seeking answers about this strange and distant moon. While Triton may seem like a frozen wasteland, it could potentially hold the secrets to life beyond Earth. Next, let's journey to Ceres, a dwarf planet nestled in the asteroid belt. This petite powerhouse, measuring just 1 20th the size of Pluto, orbits between Mars and Jupiter. Ceres is a veritable cosmic cocktail of life's key ingredients, organic compounds and water. The mix is intriguing, but the place isn't exactly cozy. The atmosphere on Ceres is as thin as a whisper, and the temperatures? Well, they're likely to freeze the whiskers off a comet. Back in 2018, a group of bright-eyed students, backed by scientists from the European Space Agency, proposed a daring mission. They wanted to collect and return samples from this icy dwarf planet. An audacious idea, sure, but one that's yet to get the green light. As we consider the vastness of our universe, we must remember, size isn't everything. Despite its small size, Ceres might be a giant when it comes to the possibilities for life. Now, let's explore Io, Jupiter's most volcanically active moon. It's a place of extremes, with magma spewing volcanoes dotting its icy surface. This celestial body's fiery personality is further intensified by the relentless radiation from Jupiter, its parent planet. Now you might be thinking, surely, these harsh conditions make it impossible for life to thrive there? Well, not so fast. Some scientists argue that despite its inhospitable surface, Io could be hiding secrets deep beneath its icy exterior. They theorize that water ice and possibly even liquid water once existed on Io's surface. Not only that, but these life-sustaining materials could still be tucked away underground, kept warm by the heat from the ceaseless volcanic activity. You see, these extreme conditions might actually provide the perfect recipe for life to take root. So, while Io's surface may be a hotbed of volcanic activity, its fiery exterior could be a smokescreen for life's beginnings. Io's fiery exterior might be deceiving, could it be hiding life beneath its surface? Next, we'll visit Callisto, one of Jupiter's largest moons discovered by the Galileo probe. This celestial body has long intrigued scientists, sparking curiosity with the potential of hidden oceans beneath its icy surface. The Galileo probe, in its journey between 1995 and 2003, found tantalizing evidence that these oceans might indeed exist. Peering beneath the frosty exterior, the probe discovered hints of vast expanses of liquid water. Think about it. Oceans, not on our blue planet, but millions of miles away on a moon orbiting Jupiter. That's not all though, Callisto's thin atmosphere is believed to contain key elements, hydrogen, carbon dioxide, and oxygen. The vital trifecta for the existence of life as we know it. The possibility of such an environment, hidden beneath a veneer of ice, sets the imagination alight. Could Callisto be a sanctuary for life in the vast emptiness of space? To find out, we look to the future, specifically to the European Space Agency's Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, affectionately known as JUICE. This mission, which launched in 2023, is set to arrive at Jupiter in December 2031. 
It's a long journey but one filled with promise and anticipation. Juice is set to make 21 flybys of Callisto, each one an opportunity to gather more data and unravel the moon's secrets. With each pass we get closer to answering the burning question, does Callisto indeed have a subsurface ocean? The mission carries the hopes of countless scientists and space enthusiasts, all waiting with bated breath for the revelation that could rewrite our understanding of the cosmos. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of our universe, each discovery, each hint at the possibility of life beyond our planet, fuels our quest for knowledge. Callisto, with its hidden oceans and atmospheric concoction of life-sustaining elements, stands as a testament to the wonders that lie in wait, hidden in the farthest corners of our solar system. Callisto's icy surface might be shielding a world of liquid water. Could this be a haven for life? Finally, we'll explore Ganymede, the solar system's largest moon. This celestial giant is not just fascinating due to its size. Beneath its icy surface, Ganymede may be harboring a secret of massive proportions, a vast, salty ocean. This ocean isn't just a small puddle, mind you. It's thought to potentially contain more water than all of Earth's oceans, lakes, and rivers combined. Isn't that something? In the quest to unravel this mystery, the European Space Agency's Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, or JUICE, is set to perform 12 flybys of Ganymede. Using its advanced cameras, sensors, and radar, JUICE will seek to determine whether this massive ocean exists. But the mission doesn't stop there. JUICE could even detect molecules produced by life, hinting at the tantalizing possibility of extraterrestrial existence beneath Ganymede's icy exterior. Ganymede, the giant moon of Jupiter, may be hiding a vast ocean teeming with life. Only time will tell.